Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Chrono Cross. Today, we're going to be finally entering the Dead Sea and seeing what's up. So, let's just go. Oh, we got to use the Fiddler Crab, right? Yeah. That is the item that the Sage gave us last episode on the SS Zelbez or whatever it's called. Boom, the mountains are falling or something. And a path has been cleared to the Dead Sea. Look at that. Would you look at that? All right, let's go to Death's door. So Sage knew what he was doing, apparently. Radius is here. Oh, okay. <laughs> so can I move or what's going on here? All right, real quick, let's save. I do not think there's a boss up ahead, but it's better to be safe than sorry. Let's go up in here. So there is a red sword stuck in the ground. What is the evil sword Masamune doing here? I don't know. What is that sword doing here? Ugh, it's no use. We will not be able to proceed without going mad. Serge, we have no choice but to withdraw for now. Dang it, can't we just like <laughs> run past it? Like. Like two seconds? It's like sprint. The path appears to be blocked off by that sword. He must already be in there. The negative sentiment associated with that sword has intensified. It will be impossible to proceed without going mad. Is that the so called evil sword, Massimian Serradius? Do you know anything about the sword? What shall we do? We cannot make our way into the Dead Sea without removing the sword. Only the dragon sword, Ein Lane. I don't know how to say that. I can break the seal of the Massimian. The sword forged by the ancient Dragonians. Truly. Yes, the legendary holy sword forged by the Dragon Knights. I have placed that sword to rest beside its rightful owner, Garia. May he rest in peace without... Although it pains me to disturb his eternal sleep, we have no other choice. Where is the cavern? We know it today as the Isle of the Damned. It used to be an ordinary cavern until it mutated into a nest ground for demons. I believe that this may be the result of Gary... Garia's sentiments, which lingered. Negative sentiment, which... The holy sword could not even restrain in order to make our way in there. We need a certain item that Garia used while he was still alive. I have sorted away in a hut where Garia and I used to train. We must go there and get the item. Alright. Let's do this. Get in the boat. Alright, so where we gotta go is to the hermit's hut thingamajigger. Which is... Right over here. And the Isle of the Damned is the one right to the right. But first, we must go to Hermit's Hideaway. And see what's good. It took you long enough. I've been waiting for... Bro, I drove you here. What? Dario's father, Garia, and I used to frequent the island for our training. So, there's like a solid eight islands on this entire El Nido, and one of them is solely for training. Sigh, I lose again. Hm, you're always a half step too slow, and you have a habit of turning your wrist down when you swing. I can read your every move. Ah, uh, you're about the only one who knows that since we practice together so often. And I thought I was a genius. Yeah, right. Uh, as a legendary sword passed on to the most skilled swordsman of the eight. The Dragoons, it belonged to Garia before Daria, Dar Dario, Dario took over the title. He was a magnificent dragoon. Could this really be it? The Sword of Legend, the Masamun. My word. Leave it alone, there's something wrong about this. What could be a, this is a legendary sword. No, don't touch it. See, Garia, there's nothing to fear. Hmm, perhaps not. Let's go, Radius. No use hanging around this eerie place. Ah. Well, uh, this part up here is uh, kind of sad. So, not, not safe for sadness. The Moss Immune, the sword is cursed with hate and sorrow. Anyone who lays his hands on it will overcome with negative sentiment and will be driven mad. I. Enough talk from an old man. Just wait here a moment. Ah, uh, he killed that guy. Haha. <laughs> Spoilers. We'll probably see in a clip here in a second. Oh, oh, are we supposed to walk? Okay, thought we were waiting for him. Alright, let's go up in his little treehouse. See what's good. 
Oh, um. Hello? Can we not go in here? There he, okay. Oh, see, we legitimately had to wait for him. It's like the first time the game's ever done that, where we, where we actually had to wait <laughs> instead of going to follow him. Sorry to keep you waiting. Yeah, you're right. With this merit, we shall be able to make it to the inner parts of the Isle of the Damned. Garia's keepsake. Let us be off to the Isle of the Damned. I agree. Let us get going. To the Isle of the Damned. Which is... Right here. Where do we stop? Hello? Oh, okay. We stopped right where I thought I would be. Uh, let's go in here. So, this is the type of place that you'd probably explore before you are able to go in. But I didn't bother coming here because I knew I couldn't get very far. But now we're here. And this place is very creepy. There's bones and eyeballs and dirty water and creepy music and uh, demons. So that's great, right? Alright. Gotta get past there, right? So we probably have to defeat this, to my best of knowledge. Bum, bum, bum. Right, come on. Animation takes so long. I just want to beat the crap out of these things. One hit. Two hit. Three hit. Uh, let's use glide hook. The thing is red, so we should use blue stuff on it, but oh well. Bam. Okay, dead. I was gonna say, if that thing doesn't die, I'll be surprised. One hit, two hit. Ooh, okay. Too bad it got a move off. That's fine, though. No biggie. That'll hurt about 100. Ah, only 50. Okay, cool. Alright, come on, gunman. Boom. One shot to the face. There we go. HP, HP, HP. Let's make sure we heal. We got a few fire elements that we do not need. Okay, bam. We blew open the fire thingy and we can go in. Okay, so those flying things are creatures that we can fight. So, where we need to go... Hello? Okay, well, we're, where we need to go is over here. -na 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 -na. Is over here. Yep, so we go over here and use Garia's keepsake. And uh, we can walk right in. Look at that. Easy. Okay, and then we walk over here. But maybe not. I don't know. Either way, we're going through this door. That's for sure. Oh, do, do, do. oh okay. Oh, go ahead. Link, Sarl Norris, may you all rest in peace. Oh, no, Garia. Near day passes where I haven't looked back on the day. I was overcome by the power of that sword. Yes, you truly were, my friend. This is the scene that I was talking about earlier. Who would have thought we'd find the Masamune in a place like this, Radius? I know. Hey, Garia, what? Oh! Arg, what the... Ha ha ha, now I'm the top swordsman of the Dragoons. Ha, I did it. I am the greatest. Huh? What happened? Ah, uh, this... Oh, Lord, what have I done? The sword took over you, my dude. No, yeah. That's why I shouldn't mess with spooky swords, my man. Spooky swords aren't good. They do spooky things. I know, I lost my sanity because of that sword, but I must admit that the sword is not entirely to blame. I was jealous of Gary. I wanted to be the better swordsman. I once renowned... Ma the once renowned master me in the whole... Holy sword that conquered darkness. Could it merely me? It could it merely be a tool for murder? Should you feel remorse for what you have done, then may you fall by my sword, you traitor. Oh boy, Garia, no. <clears throat> Listen to me, Garia. We need to end whatever to seal the blah blah blah. Then express your intent to the blah blah blah. The true swords would do. You must defeat me to proceed. In order to Believe what is right, one must suffer pain and sorrow. Do not hesitate. Show me with the pride and honor of the Acacia Dragoons. Come on, Radius. <clears throat> Let's do it.
do this. Now, <clears throat> Radius is not in my party, so technically he's not fighting him. But I am fighting him. So, what color is he? He's white? Perfect. Two of us are black. Alright, let's try not to hit. Or let's try not to miss. Good shots, good shots. How strong is he? Ooh, that. 52. It's quite a hit. Aw, oh, man, it reset my damage. Or, it reset my thingy. Alright, let's do a glide hook. This should hurt quite a bit. Again, it's kind of good that we have two black characters. That hits quite hard. And a Haro should hit even harder. 24, 61. How much would this hit? Over 100. Triple cut. Oh. This is going to be like 150. Yeah. Ooh. Let's go ahead and use... Uh, let's use Moonbeams. Yeah. And this should hurt quite a bit too. About 150 to 200. Over 200. I like that. Uh, with him, he doesn't do as much damage. But, uh, we should use a heal all. Just for Harl's sake. If Harl gets hit again by something big, she dead. So, it'd be good to keep her... Ow, ow. Okay. Let's use that, that. Man, search it's like a truck. Let's use feral cats. This should hurt a lot. Once again, this is a dark color ability, so I'd expect this to hit quite a bit harder than normal abilities. 225, that's pretty good. Okay, let's try to hit. Okay, good. Two hits, nice. Okay, Harl. That's actually, I'm actually happy that she got, okay buddy, calm down, I'm actually happy she got hit, because I was going to use heal all with her anyway, but jeez man, the dude's just going into her, slash and slash and slash, 250, what is that heal, one shot, two shot, three shot, four, alright, uh, let's make some bullet rain, you know what I mean? Make some bullet rain. Boom. Alright, I didn't do that much, but it's kind of what I expected. Defend. Defend. Oh, I wanted to defend with Norris. If he hits Norris, this is gonna hurt. Oh, it's gonna hurt anybody. Oh, of course he hits Norris. Dude, what a bum. Bro, why you gotta do this? Alright, as long as we get to uh, Cure Plus. Yeah. Let's heal up our boy Norris right quick. Make sure he don't die. 160? Okay. Uh, I should make him survive. I'll wait until... Oh, he's already low on health? I'm just gonna go at him then. Full speed ahead. Ow. Only once? Oh boy. What are you doing? You're weak. Bah, you know what? I'm just gonna go with Lynx. We're going in, boys. Slice and dice and ah, oh, you missed, you bum. Triple cut. I think he's going for surge. Oh, it's gonna hurt. Oh, that was five over the limit, you bum. That's fine. Let's go ahead and revive Norris, and then hopefully we can finish him off with Harl. I'm hoping. I don't have another revive. I don't think so. Come on, kill him. No! Okay, he's going for links. That's fine. Ooh. Ooh. Those are some shots right there. You know what? Uh. Norris. Does Norris have heal all? Yes. Let's go ahead and, uh. Yeah, uh, heal up. I don't want to lose anybody because I want them to get their experience. So let's defend, defend, defend. And that will reduce damage on all of us and give us some stamina. Oof. Aw, oh, come on. Why, why are you about to hit three times? That's fine, though. We should be able to kill him right here, honestly. Wow. Yeah, yeah, he's dead. I told you. I knew we could have finished him right there. Garia is no longer the best swordsman. I am. Banana. Well, technically not swordsman, because I use a... Uh... <clears throat> 
I use a, whatever that thing is called. <clears throat> a sea swallow. Right, let's make sure we heal. We got another dragoons on it. <clears throat> That's good stuff right there. And I got something in my throat. Link's received the sword. Okay, cool. Oh, it sounded so gross, but I need some water right now. Getting intense. I have always been prepared to fall to a sword held by one of your sons. Perhaps Glenn will take on that role now that Dario is gone. <clears throat> However, I must attend to some unfinished business. Please wait a little longer, Dario. Forgive me, my friend. Alright, sick. We got the sword, fam. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure we're going to be able to go in there now. Hopefully. There's also that thingy. Get me rolling. Alright, you know what? We haven't fought one of these. Uh, it's probably <clears throat> a good idea to fight it. Take a look at its animation, sprites, movesets. Just for giggles. Power dive. That's a cool move. Oh, the thing hits hard. Alright, I like it. Cool stuff, my dude. Go ahead, hit that three. Get out of here. I mean, I hit one more. Bloop. Let's go ahead and use our feral cats. See how they like cats. I don't like cats. Maybe that's partly why I actually don't like links that much. I don't really like cats. But I like Carl. Carl is cool. Boom. Dead. Let's see. Can she snipe a 72? She can, look at her. Get a 95. What? That thing's not dead? Alright, 68, I believe. Okay. Alright, he hit another shot, though. Aw, oh, come on, man. Why didn't that kill him? How much HP does this stupid bird have? Actually, that thing actually hits pretty hard, low key, though. Alright, hit that 68. I believe in you. There you go. Mmm. Mmm. That three crit. I'll take it. Bum, 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 bum. I will take it, honestly. And I'll take that gold. That's my gold now, boy. Get out of here. Alright, let's head over. Let's head over to the Dead Sea. And see what's going on. I'll probably scoot over this way. I think my camera's a little off. By the way, guys. It's, some, it's one thing that I haven't addressed with this game. Another reason why I love this game so much is just for the fact that there's not random encounters like a lot of other games. As you can see, all enemies... You, the only time you need to fight them is when you touch them. And I think that is a great system. Also, there is a very great anti-grind system in in like incorporated into the game where you don't need to grind like other games. You basically just need to defeat the enemies in that room and continue and you'll be fine. But, I mean, five minutes of grinding compared to like a couple hours of grinding, I'll take it. So let's go ahead and save. Boop. And let's continue. Now we have the sword to get past the other sword. Spooky waves and stuff. Oh, Garia, we shall use the holy powers of the sword that I can't pronounce. Boom, right on the ground. Oh, the sword is a reflection of one of... How I pity you. You've done nothing wrong either. Aha! No! You broke the sword! I just hope that one day that sword will be freed of em Bro, you broke the sword! Why would you break the sword? I mean, I guess we need to get past whatever. Still, man, that is a perfectly good sword. It looked cool, too. Why you gotta do that? Alright, let's head into the Dead Sea. Now, this is one of the most interesting places, it, it, basically the most mysterious and coolest place in this entire game. This is the Dead Sea. It is some sight. I feel like I'm living a nightmare. Literally. Look, the waves are at a standstill. That is how the game looks. What is that shadow in the distance? Uh, blah, blah, blah. So literally, here time is stuck. It is literally stuck. And is that an enemy? I think that is an enemy. So all of these places are a place. So right there, that is the broken highway. We're going to have to go through that. We're going to have to go through that. We found an anti-red. 
So, uh, I'm pretty sure this does act like a world map. So we can do like the smithy spirit and save and stuff like that. Real quickly, can we forge a little weapon for my boy Norris over here? Where? Okay, can we? Nah, we still don't have a mithril, man. That's annoying. All right. Well, um, we're at about 25 minutes, and I. Oh no! What have I done? And I don't really want to end. The, I don't want to end the episode yet. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna save and we're gonna keep moving just for a little bit longer, uh, because hint, hint, there is a boss. And these things, by the way, aren't save points. It's kind of deceiving. They're not save points. They're actually just basically like teleport points. Um... Oh, these are enemies. Good to know. Good to know. I didn't know those were enemies. Bum, bum, bum. All right, well, let's see how strong they are for research purposes. Okay. He takes normal amount of damage. Let's see how about how much health he has. Light health. You have been... Okay. He's already low. He's clearly not that strong, then. Does he even attack? Well, I don't know if he attacks, but he's definitely dead. That's for sure. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. Alright, cool. So, uh... There's a chest. Like, right below us. Over here. And this is truly a sad, sad place. Can't carry more capsules. This place is literally just a nightmare, basically. All right, that is a boss right there. So uh, we saved, we got all our dudes up and running. You know what? Let's go straight into here. Let's, what's up, dude? What's up? Let's go. Let's beat this thing. He doesn't even know what's coming. Very big engines. Alright, what's up, dude? What's your name? What what color are you? He's black. The highwayman. Alright. Well, the highwayman. Prepared to be slain. Ooh, that was a crispy hit. How hard is he hit? Ah, oh, bro. He hits kind of like Garia. That ain't that bad. That ain't bad at all. I'm not gonna hit him with that glide hook. I'm just gonna go over to Harl. That she can attack. Ooh, oh, I was gonna say, if you missed that girl. Alright, good hits. Let's go over to Norris. One hit, two hit, three hit, four. How many people are at my door? 60, that's a good hit. No! It's full of Tom Beam, bro. This guy's black, so a white element should be good against him. Just like that. 200 damage. Easy. 150. Close enough. This guy shouldn't be that hard, honestly. This guy's like a mini boss. Exhaust gas. I'm pretty sure this poisons? What does this do? Um. Bum, 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 bum. What does this do? I don't know. We'll just use Ice Blast. I don't. Yeah. I don't know. I guess we'll see with Norris. Let's see with Norris. Can you hit? Oh, God. Our. Oh. That's not good. Our, our thingy is very low. Rampage. Oh, why did I hit Norris? Oh. <gasps> That is strong, bro. Alright, let's just do a little tap. A little tippy tap. Survivor boy Norris. He got literally, even if he was full health, he would have got killed by me. Literally no point. Alright, let's uh Let's go ahead and uh you know what actually no. Does Man, okay. Let's just heal all. I don't want to use a heal all because not everyone's hurt, only one, but at this point, whatever. Norris needs some healing. Man, Harl is not. Uh, you know, let's defend Norris, actually. Okay, we're defending with all of them. Good. 
Miss. Haha. 21. 21. 21. 21. Let's do this. Ah, oh, why is your... Mm. Okay, you know what we're going to have to do? Let's go with up here in links. Try to not miss. Hit that too. And then... Use this on Carl. So she could stop missing. That'd be great. Yes, there we go. Be gone. Now we can hit. One, two, three, four. That wasn't that bad, actually. Except now our percentages are reset. Let's just go to Norris. Bam. Bam. Oh, you missed. Bam. Is he getting low yet? I don't know. Either way, let's use a heal all. Uh, both Norris and Harl are a little bit hurt. Wouldn't hurt to do some healing. Just go to Harl since she's at seven. She's a two. Okay, I was about to go to Lynx. Miss. You suck. Let's go to Lynx. Hit him good, Lynx. Nice, good hit. And then we're just gonna go to Harl. Hit him with that two. You missed. Hit him with that three. Yeah. That's how I like it. Let's go to Norris. No, let's go back to Lynx, actually. Back to Lynx. Oh. Dang it. Exhaust gas. Okay, so we're back to the whole paralyzing thing. Please miss everybody. Oh, I missed everyone. What? That's fine, actually. Let's use another one of these. Norris doesn't do much damage anyway. For all I care, he doesn't even have to hit his shots. Honestly. Uh, let's see. 34. Okay, of course he missed the 34. I'm delusional. Alright, let's hit him with the Harl. Bam, bam. Bam. Brain pa Oh, someone's dead. Oh, okay. Lynx is a big boy. He can take it. Okay, let's go over to Lynx. Let's try to hit, okay? Because we can use a Cure Plus. I'm just gonna Cure Plus myself, make sure I don't die here. Go back. Oh, I don't want to go to Norris, actually. He can't hit nothing. Missed. How do you miss a 96? Uh, let's go ahead and Ice Blast him. This guy is still not low. That's actually surprising. Oh, I need to hit him with some more magic. Jeez, if I can hit him at all. I actually hit him. I hit him. I hit him twice with 30%. Dude, my boy Norris is nutty. Let's go to his elements. Let's see if we can hit him one more. Oh, my boy. Um, Let's see. He can't even do much, actually. Uh, let's use mm, Photon Beam. That that should do quite a little bit of damage. More than his normal attacks, at least. That's what it is. Boom. Nine. Okay, he's low. Finally. What? Now let's go to Harl. Hit him with the best shot. Damn. Alright. Don't kill my boy, Norris. Please and thank you. Alright, let's go back to Lynx. Boy, come on. Bro! This always happens, man. At the end of fight, Surge just... Misses everything. He gets too excited. Alright, you know what? Hit Lynx. Lynx has great defense and agility. You can't beat him. Oh, oh, man, he always misses the triple. The third one. That's fine. Ice Blast should do about 200 damage. This may, might kill him. No, I can't do it. But this definitely will not. Okay. Exhaust gas. Well, luckily for us, that actually doesn't kill us. It would have been more brutal if it actually did something. Oh, it didn't hit. It only hit Harl. You know what? 
I can play your game. Bro, how do you like an electro bolt to the face? How about that, huh? Electro bolt, right, right in the... Right in the... Oh! Yeah, that should be him gone. Boom. You're dead, boy. You're dead. Bum, 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 bum. Cool. That boss took forever, but was a fairly easy one at that, though. Definitely a, one of the easier bosses. And it was not even, like, technically a real boss. It was kind of just a boss placed there because... Well, what is this? Hello? Okay. It was just basically a boss placed there because, hey, we need a boss here. Uh, some guy with a brain make a boss quickly and then they just made us a, a spooky uh, machine Okay, follow okay good But we have beaten the spooky machine and for now I'm gonna go save real quick uh, Because we are done with this episode guys. Thanks for watching if you did enjoy make sure like in the comment as well as the channel And next time we will explore further on so guys Yeah, thanks for watching. God bless and goodbye